The Agriculture Services Office of the City of Imus organized a three-day agricultural trade fair in line with the celebration of Farmers Week. Marife Bitana, a vegetable producer, started producing locally grown vegetables after she was diagnosed with a heart disease five years ago. According to Bitana, it started off as a hobby then eventually became her family's main source of income. Nakaprovide kami ng mga needs ng mga kapatid. Hindi na namin po bumuhay ng pagbigas, yung pagkulam, yung pagbaho ng mga anak mo. Malaki ang naitutulong ng mga ganitong trade fair. Bitana is one of the admin and founding members of the Cavite Gardeners Club. Well, similarly, City Agriculturist Roberto Marges said that the agriculture industry is still profitable in the city of Imus. Uh, talagang uh, nag-generate ng income, lalo na yung vegetable production. Mas malaki ang, product, ang uh, income kung tutusin sa vegetable production kaysa sa rice production. Marges added that even though the city is on its way to modernization, their office still continues to promote organic farming, introduce new planting techniques, and organize agricultural activities. Meanwhile, Marife Bitana said that she is looking forward for another trade fair, be it in the city of Imus or in the other parts of the province. Despite the urbanization the city of Imus is gearing to, the city agricultural office hopes to bag the title of the first organic farming capital in Cavite in the near future and at the same time boost their local economy through the continuous production of their native products. Ivan Medina, reporting from the front line.